Hi, today we'll derive identity for a plus b whole cube. a plus b whole cube. As we know, this can be written as a plus b multiplied by a plus b whole square. Right? Now let's expand it further. a plus b will be written as it is and now if we expand a plus b whole square this we'll get a square plus 2ab plus b square. Right? So now let's follow the steps of multiplications again. Here now we'll take this a first and then we'll multiply it to all the terms. Right? So what will we get? We are going to get a multiplied by a square that is a cube a multiplied by plus 2ab so we'll get plus 2 a square b then a multiplied by b square so we'll get plus a b square right now a has got multiplied to all the terms of the second bracket now we have to take the second term that is b of the first bracket and again repeat the procedure that is we have to multiply it to all the terms of the second bracket right so when this b gets multiplied to a square we'll get plus a square b and when b gets multiplied to 2ab we'll get plus 2ab square And when this b gets multiplied to b square, we'll get one term which will be plus b square. Now let's look for the like terms and accumulate them. So we have a cube, first term is a cube, but there is no other term which has a cube. So we'll write a cube as it is. Then the second term we have is plus 2 a square b and we have one more a square b over here so 2 a square b plus a square b will be 3 a square b right and the next term we have is a b square and we have 2 a b squares here so it will be total plus 3 a b square and the last term will be plus this it is b square but we are not supposed to get any term with b square it should be b cube so let me correct it as b cube because this is the term which we are getting when we multiply this b to b square so b square multiplied by b will be b cube and the last term we are going to get in this expression will be b cube so this is the formula for a plus b whole cube a plus b whole cube whole cube equal to a cube plus 3 a square b plus 3 a b square plus b cube this is the formula for a plus b whole cube right this formula can also be 
rewritten in one more format which is a cube plus b cube plus if you see these two terms carefully both of them have one three one a and one b a three a and b so this 3ab can be taken as common and from the first term we'll have a which is left behind and from the second term we'll have a b which is left behind. Why? Because this is b square and this is a square and I'm taking only 1a and 1b as common. So the term which is left behind if we take 3ab as common will be a plus b. So this is actually easy to remember formula for, for a plus b whole cube.